All right, we're live. Uh, good morning. Good morning, everyone. We're here uh, in an ongoing uh, project in Covington, Georgia, in this beautiful uh, Wednesday. Behind me is the house that we're doing some work at. Right now, we have uh, the framing done. We're doing the roofing for electrical, plumbing, and HVAC. This is an interesting property because it's uh, 100 years old, and we're restoring most of it. And the exterior side, we're trying to keep as much as we can in order to keep the character. But I just want to give you a small tour about what we're doing in here. Uh, let's check it out. Okay, we have the porch. You, we, we try to actually keep uh, the existing, like a layout. We just replicate the existing railing. We talked to the city and they were really, you know, willing to, to just keep the, or trying to keep as original as possible. We replaced the windows. We had some windows on the back. It's a complete renovation right here. We're going to go in and trying to explain a little bit what we're doing here. All the front porch flooring has been replaced. And right now, as we speak, we're doing the um, electrical rough. The guys in here working. They're doing all the wiring. The HVAC is already done. The framing is completed. We replaced the stairwell completely. We relocated in order to comply with the clearance code. We have in here one of the bedrooms. New windows, new headers, still ongoing with the HVAC. But as you see, most of the framing has been completed and it's almost new. We level in here, in here some flooring. Let's keep going. Here we go to the kitchen. We're going to have, we're adding uh, actually the second floor. We're going to add uh, one bedroom, uh, two bedrooms and one bath on the second level. This is the kitchen area right here. We're going to have a bathroom below the stairwell. We keep going on the hallway. This is going to be one bathroom. We're going to uh, do the shower below the stairwell area. Kind of interesting concept, but it was the only place to put another, another bathroom in this floor. We have in here the laundry room, still ongoing. And you do them all the all the rough is going to be new electrical plumbing and HVAC. It's going to be the master bedroom, a really good size. We add an LBL beam in here in order to support the addition that someone did around 20 years ago. We have the closet, we have the master bath right here. We're getting almost ready to pass the first uh, part of the inspection. It's going to be the framing, uh, insulation, and all the roughing traits. Here we go back and we're going to go to the second level. So we relay out the stairwell. We need to reframe to uh, comply with the clearance. In here, the stairwell that we're running actually toward the front door. So we just make a, a landing and a small turn in order to make that happen. We have some temporary railings in here. This house, it has a, it had a fire damage, extensive one. We use Sister Joy's the Raptors. We're going to apply a oil based primer and a foam insulation in order to contain the smell. At the beginning when we started the project, actually we you can smell really easily uh, the, the smoke, but right now actually smelling really good. We've been working in here two and a half weeks. The progress is awesome. And as I said, we're ready to the first step on the inspection process. We have another bathroom in here that we'll reframe. All the new furnace is already in. And we're going to have another bedroom in here. All the second level, it was an attic, and right now we have uh, two bedrooms and one bath. Uh, night for a bonus room for the kids. 
But as I, as I commit myself, I'm going to actually start sending videos in every job site that I'm, I'm, that I'm currently working at. And I just want to show you and share with you guys uh, this renovation in Covington. As any renovation, really challenging. Uh, a lot of reframing, all the flooring here, and the second level at least, it was done. And we're getting ready for the inspections. Stay tuned, uh, leave a comment, a question if you have any, feel free to reach out. We're here to help you out. Have a good day and uh, stay tuned.